Welcome friends here is the second part of question number one of exercise 2.3 of chapter 2 and same as uh, we have to divide the polynomial px by the polynomial gx and we have to find the quotient and the remainder so let us see how to do it since we have to divide px by gx this means px is a uh, dividend so we shall write px here x raised to the fourth power minus 3x square plus 4x plus 5 and the divisor is x square minus x plus 1 we have to write the divisor and the dividend in its standard form so to find the first term in the quotient we have to divide x raised to the fourth power this means first term of the dividend by the first term of the divisor this means by x square then we have x square so first term in quotient is x square now we shall multiply x square with all three terms of the divisor and write here x raised to the fourth power minus x cube because there is no term here in the dividend of the variable x raised to the third third power so we shall write x cube here and here we have x square and now we shall change the sign of these terms we can cancel out these values and now we have x cube and here we have minus 4x square plus 4x plus 5 and to find the next sum in the quotient we have to divide this x cube by x square this x square is the first term of the divisor then we have x so the next term in the quotient is x and if we multiply x with these three terms of the divisor then we have x cube uh, minus x square and plus x and now we shall change the sign of these terms here we have minus 3x square plus 3x plus 5 and uh, for to find the next term in the, the quotient we have to divide minus 3x square by x square then we have minus 3 the next term in the quotient is minus 3 and if we multiply minus 3 with these three terms of the divisor then we have minus 3x square plus 3x minus 3 and now we shall change the sign of these terms then this term this term is cancelled out and now we have 8 so the quotient is x square plus x minus 3 x square plus x minus 3 and the remainder is 8 so this is the solution of the question thank you